Indies was set up with a vision to uh, empower independent workers, platform workers, work with uh, B2B platforms such as the Deliveroo's and Ubers of the world uh, to take care of the financial well-being of their community of workers. Independent workers in Europe and all over the world are growing. Uh, we see already 30-40% of the workforce today in Europe being independent, uh, about 43 million expected to be platform workers by year 2025. This is a significant growth and uh, a significant uh, opportunity and an imperative for the society to act towards creating a much more equitable, balanced, sustainable workforce. Independent workers today do not enjoy the same benefits as their counterparts who have full-time employment. And this is really where Indies comes in by designing simple and affordable insurance products that protect their income and create everyday benefits uh, that empower their lives and takes care of them financially in several ways. Quite frankly, I was quite impressed with the, uh, with the founder-centric approach that Eli has had. They are one of the rare few European VCs who are founder-centric and who have engaged and built their business model around the vision and the aspiration and convictions of the founder. Also, it was important for us to have strong legitimacy in the French market as we were going for Series A funding. Uh, obviously, our seed investors were non-French were non uh, and here, Elia fit the bill perfectly. Uh, local investor with a global ambition and who would kind of accompany us in that journey. My first conversation with Elia was not in person. I was meeting with Armel and Gabriel on a VC call. In fact, my first couple of conversations were on a video call. My first conversation specifically was interesting because the internet connection in this office was terrible that day for some reason, out of my control. And I wasn't sure how much of what I was saying was getting through. So I walked out of the meeting giving myself less than 50% chance that what I was trying to say was what was actually understood. However, I was quite pleasantly surprised when they came back and I realized that even despite the poor internet connection, the convictions and the messaging around key points of Indy's business model was very well understood and rest is history, right? Mm -hmm.